This build is a magnetic knife block. Chose to use black walnut, maple, and a little purple heart. And uh, right now I'm just resawing some dimensional lumber for some small glue ups. I chose to use a little Type Bond 3 on these glue ups. Type Bond 3 is a waterproof glue, so it wasn't that necessary with this project. You could have used Type Bond 1, 2, or 3. I just had more 3 in the shop, so that's why I chose it. I did go back and put a little clamp on these as well. About this. I'm using the Shaper Origin to cut out some little pocket cuts for the magnets. Now you could do this with a router of any sort, but I chose to use the Shaper Origin because I did have it and it sure makes it pretty nice and easy. Now I didn't show it in here, but I basically am sliding this out and I slid another piece of walnut in there to cut the plugs to fill the gaps. So I bought the magnets from KJ Magnets. They have a great chart to help you figure out what size and what strength you need. And I chose to use Starbond to put this plug in because it does cure very quickly and I can move on with the project. You definitely can use any kind of wood glue for this if you choose. Just using a little block plane to kind of get that plane back out nice and flush so I can move on with the project. Again, going back with Type Bond 3, you can go with Type Bond 2 or 1. And now I'm basically just layering up the small glue ups. Now, what I didn't show is planing those glue ups down. I did plane those down nicely. And uh, doing a little clamp action to get those nice and glued up. Now here I am trimming up the edges. You really have to take note of where the magnets are so you don't chop your magnets. And here I am putting a little angle on this for shorter and longer knives. And again, take note where the magnet is so you don't cut your magnet. So I'm working on the base. I chose to put some feet on this base. So I'm using the dado and basically putting four small feet on all corners of the block. So now I'm flipping it over so I can insert the knife holder in this dado out section. Now I just glued the little sandpaper on that block of plywood so I could get a nice little sand on it. And fitting this in nicely, I chose to use a few screws. I did pocket them in and put some plugs so you can't see them. And it is on the bottom, so I feel okay about that. So being that this is holding knives, I wanted a food grade oil on this, so I chose walrus oil, cutting board oil to finish this up with. And there you go, one magnetic knife holder.